Everyone knows that Horizon is the first all-Filipino boy group that debuted in South Korea, and since they are managed by Korean companies they go through the K-pop training system. Learning the language and the culture were part of their training, and as we can see, Horizon adopts the Korean manners. Horizon might live in the Korean cultures as long as they are Horizon, but it will not change the fact that they are born and raised in the Philippines. It is not easy to remove or forget manners or mannerisms and cultures that someone grew up with, because they are already programmed in the subconscious mind. That's why even though Horizon was trained to act in the manners that they were taught, their Filipino traits are still overtaking. In all episodes of 100 Days Miracle and some videos of Horizon that were released in their official YouTube channel, I noticed three Filipino traits that Horizon unconsciously did, or unintentionally showed in front of the camera. Before anything else, if you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe and hit the notification bell. Here are three Filipino traits that Horizon brought to South Korea. Number 3. Filipinos Happy Vibes Some surveys say that the Philippines is a country of smiles, and Filipinos are known for being jolly, and Horizon brought that vibes to South Korea. Horizon never forgets to smile, they always show happy faces, whether they are nervous or excited. They greet everyone with a smile and it shows how friendly they are. Just look at their videos, they always put smiles on their faces and it comes out naturally because it is the nature of being a Filipino. Maybe this is one of the reasons why foreigners always commented that people in the Philippines are so kind and nice. Number 2. This one is really very similar to number 3, the Filipino humor. Making fun of small things or turning a situation into a funny moment or laughing at something that is not laughable at all but somehow makes people laugh. That's how Filipinos are, and they call it being, kalog, or in English playfully crazy, and Horizon naturally has this. In their latest 100 Days Miracle episode, particularly in K-Star Road when Horizon emphasizes a fire hydrant water pipe as their sculpture, In their 16 music broadcasting behind the scene, on the glass windows in a situation where Horizon are amazed at the view, but suddenly some members sang their mama song, and feeling the moment like they are shooting a mama MV. That was so random. Filipino humor is not just about being kalog, Filipinos also love teasing and bickering. Jeremy TV, or Marcus TV. The two maknays always have the moments of bickering each other, and if you can't keep up with this humor you might think they are hiding, but it's not, it is just a part of Filipino humor. And of course, Filipino humor would be boring if teasing is not there. Filipinos love to tease especially in a group of friends and in every Filipino sibling. In fact, this teasing humor became the love language of almost every Filipino sibling out there. Number 1. Filipino Values I think all Filipinos grew up with the teachings and good manners that were passed from generation to generation, because from home to kindergarten until college, values were taught. And one of the values that was taught to every Filipino is being courteous or being polite. If you notice, in one of the videos of Horizon, Jeremy gave his seat to their manager out of respect or being considerate. I believe this trait has nothing to do with the status hierarchy or age hierarchy that is acknowledged in South Korea, it was done voluntarily because it was taught that this kind of action was a good behavior. Have you ever noticed any Filipino values or traits that Horizon did in front of the camera? Comment down below.